going on everybody it's your boy john from the gamer dude here coming you back to another episode of the saga log hopefully y'all are having a wonderful day we have jonas telling us to stop because we found the area that we were supposed to go and hopefully everything is going well our team is the same exact as last time so i will not do a team recap for you guys because i'm gonna break the mold why not i feel like sharon just tells me or jonas yeah all they went ahead just don't worry about it okay also, there's a lot more trainers in here now. I just looked at that. Like, the amount of trainers definitely increased from the last time we were here. <laughs> last time we were here, it was just like, oh, yeah, and you, you just avoid trainers and get your encounter. And now we're actually here for the story purposes. And I don't want to fight too many trainers. That is the thing. If I can avoid as many trainers as possible, that would be definitely of help. I know I can't avoid them all. AKA this trainer. Oh wait, I just avoided her. Never mind. I guess I can't avoid most trainers. Hi, 50k. How are you? I really don't want to deal with you, 50k. I get, I understand that you love me, and I get that, and I appreciate it. But you know, it's it's okay, 50k. Hi. Guess has told us that once. Guess has guess has told us that once again we should test how much power we have. We'll see if you can defeat Team Plasma. Ha 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 ha. I guess, I guess we will see how much power I truly, how much power I truly bestow. But, you know, I, I, I think, I think that it's winnable. I think that Mary can do well. That is the goal of today's episode is highlight Mary. I really don't want to highlight Mary against that, though. Uh, I want Joy's dad back. Uh, I miss Joy's dad. Joy's dad was like top tier Pokemon in, in month long, or in uh, Sogalog. I swear, the amount of I don't know, remember what series I'm doing at moments is actually ridiculous. I miss this Pokemon. There we go. I miss. Joy's dad way too much but I it's true though like Joy's dad was such a good Pokemon to have on the team it Joy's dad did some fun things and continued to just be a force to be reckoned with the entire time there was never a dull moment it's just like Joy's dad you can do it yeah like honestly it's been Joy's dad created some fun memories and I like, it was really sad to see that go. Oh my god. Um, this is bad. I think it's dead. We have to think about this. Well, shoot. I guess we should That's the only thing that makes sense. Yeah, we're back. Oh my god, that took forever. That actually did take forever. Uh, that was ridiculous, actually. Holy cow. Like, I was not expecting that. And then the fact that I had to literally struggle, struggle die. I had to die to struggle. Or not die to struggle. I had to, like, kill it via struggle. That, that, that was a process. It really was. And now I have to go back and heal because I don't have my Wonder Guard option anymore. So that first that first grunt definitely decided it was gonna be a pain in the butt because holy cow, um, I should be fine though. I just can't believe immediately the first grunt just decided, yeah, I'm gonna be that person. I'm gonna be the annoying one. And it's just like, but why? 
Like, what does what is the benefit of you being an annoying person? Like, there is never a benefit to being an annoying person. That's the true answer to the question. There is no benefit to being an annoying person. But yet they still do, and it's just like, okay. Again, Unova is a roller coaster. Unova has been the biggest roller coaster. For sure. 100%. Unova has been the biggest roller coaster at this point in time. And I'm not mad about it. It's just, it just wants to be a pain. And I just gotta let it be a pain. I think that's the biggest thing, is I'm forced, I'm here being forced to let it be a pain, rather than being like, yeah, see, I'm just gonna let it chill, I'm gonna do this, why not, there's no reason to worry, and it's just like, well, actually, little do you know, there is actually a reason to worry, and the reason is this, and it's just like, but, 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 but no. But why, you know? And it's just like, but, uh, unfortunately, the, I'm not trying to complain a lot. It's just, I, I'm, I, I should probably go to bed, to be honest. I, it's about that time for me to just hit thine hay, but, you know, I want to finish this. I want, not the entire game. Oh my God. If I did that, that'd be insane. But I want to do well and want to do this extremely well, so. And I think I can. I really do. Like I said, if I can get to the next episode where it's route, like route or the the bridge route nine and then Drayden's town, like I think that would be the best case scenario because I can I can blitz through that um in one episode. Like I I am going the speed that I anticipated going right. And that's why I'm like totally fine, just because of how I feel good completely being as anticipated and go things going as predicted. In a way, obviously, because I did not predict this many death or this much death, but we, we got it anyways. So that I did not predict. But as far as like episode structures and episodes and the way that they're going, being here at 143 was exactly what I predicted to be in. And then 144, 145, 146, 147. Um, and actually, I think I'm ahead of pace. I think I'm one episode ahead of where I said I was going to be. Because I said 148 we were going to be done. And I think right now I'm on pace for 147. So, and I don't mind being ahead. It just really depends on certain episodes and how they go and what they want to do. And it's just the big... The big question that I don't have answered is, like, like I said, the, the how long, where we, how, when until we get where, the when until we get where thing is, is exactly what I'm thinking about. It's like, and where, like I said, any, 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 like, and this is like big story portion, so like it's a good portion to be at, like, it's, it's fun, it is great, and I really love being confused. Uh, uh, that would happen. Okay. At least you're only using faint, though. Oh, my word. My confusion luck is just horrific. God. Like, if you want to talk about having bad confusion luck, this game, this game, I swear, gives you, like, the worst confusion luck in the game. Like, in, in, in any, like, so far. This, this has definitely, I feel like, given me the, the worst case of confusion, but... Two, he went two for two. On the scale of confusion. Two for two. That's a lot. That's bad for me. Good for him. Bad for me. No, I messed up. I didn't mean to do that. Why are you level 34? I didn't. I think I messed up big time. Oh, wait. It was like the slightest detour. Okay. I mean, at least the game was nice enough to be like, so I know you messed up. Here you go. <laughs> like, it didn't actually, like, destroy, mentally, completely destroy any progress that I would have had or did. It was actually. 
<laughs> Our sublets are being nice, which is great. <laughs> Better than what I could have imagined for this, honestly. Watch hog. Watch hog, huh? Mold breaker watch hog. So I'm not oblivious anymore. That should be okay. I, I, it's a watch hog. And that's why I think it's okay. If it was any other Pokemon, I'd be like, eh. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm just floating now, right? Yeah, just floating. Watch hog is. What, what Pokemon do you think is the worst normal type? Honestly, Watch hog is up there for me. Watch hog is up there as one of the worst normal types. I don't like Watch hog. I, I really think it's pretty lame. Oh, frickin' eat frack. Well, I guess that was the right thing. I just missed the item, I think. I think it was literally the right... I, I did... Yeah, like I said, I think it was the right, I just missed the item. Which is... I'm not really too worried. I'll, I, 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 I should be. I should be more worried than I am, but I really am not. Okay, come on, Angry Dino. Show them what you've got. Show them what you got, Angry Dino. Oh, Angry Dino, show us what you have. It is gonna be fun. Angry Dino, I love you, but you really don't love me. E -e. Prove them wrong. No. <laughs> didn't prove them wrong, Angry Dino. You didn't prove that. I guess that crit would have been overkill, to be honest. Solar Beam, absolutely not. You don't need grass moves, Mary. You you need you need you need ice moves, not grass moves. I love you, Mary, but but no. Why? Why I learned grass moves, especially two turn ones. As you you've been with me long enough to know I don't like two turn moves. Ah, uh, so they. Th this caves caves cave areas i swear i swear i hate caves like this is so annoying how many encounters you get in the buildings and stuff that like allow encounters it's just like it's like you're gonna have a hundred encounters you're just gonna have to deal with it it's just like but but but, but, but game why why make me deal with somebody like i guess i could buy repels so they're not really making me deal with it i'm just silly enough not to ever buy repels because i'm like i don't need them it's gonna be fine we're chill and it's just like no john no you are not but you can pretend that you're chill and it, you know we'll give you a little something for trying but yeah my my oofs on that front are very much lar at large. And I do need to get better at, like, remembering what I need to bring for certain areas. Like, if I'm going to complain about encounters and how many encounters there are going to be, I should probably get repels. And I should probably fix the problem because I have access to fixing the problem. So it's not like I can't fix the problem. But, I, you know, complaining is something that is just fine. Arsarang, okay. Angry Dino! Dun, 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 dun. So, Angry Dino has a fun move. And Angry Dino has a gimmick that I really love for this generation, which is why I picked Angry Dino to be with us and hopefully the final team. But Rock Slide, we have no luck because Rock Slide has a 50% or a 30% chance to flinch. If I'm faster, Angry Dino's a fast boy. It has a 33% chance to crit. There we go. Um, and then a 10% chance to miss. So there is basically a 66 or 63.3% chance that something is happening, and a very slight 10% chance that it's negative, and a, the rest is nothing happens. Uh, also, well, actually, that's a lie, because technically speaking, the chance is there's a chance of a crit and flinch. Um, isn't it like, I don't know how percentages work or what they do, but like, if it's a 33% chance to flinch, 
or a 33.3% chance to crit. And then a 30% chance to flinch. How did that percent, like, there's a group that is flinch and crit. That's the group I'm thinking of. Like, there's that group, right? And then it's just flinch and then just crit. What is it? Oh my god, brain. Flinch and crit. Would make up a percentage. One third time. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got it, got it, got it. Um, one third and three tenths. So, it'd be... 10 thirtieths. Times. Wait. Yeah. Times nine thirtieths. So, wait, yeah, ten. So it'd be. I probably oofed. Um, I did. Uh oh. Three, oh, wait, wait, oops. One third times three tenths. One divided by three times three divided by ten is zero point one. That actually. Yeah, oh my god, it is. Okay, so, wow, okay, that's actually pretty cool. So, it's a, so basically, it's a 10% chance to flinch and crit, a 33% chance to crit, a 30% chance to flinch, which makes up 73%, and then a... 10% chance to miss, which makes up 83%, and then the 16.6 .6 chance of nothing happening. Boom! Math, how it works. Okay, so, so basically, we got unlucky when nothing happened the, for that time. But yeah, Rock Slide is such a good move, and has a 26.6% .6 chance of doing nothing. And it's fun to kind of see what could it could be and how things uh, could end up being because things can just turn on a dime right anything can turn on a dime and if something bad does end up happening what is like I, the consequence is basically Dino angry Dino's the life so like I feel like every move if I'm going against a Pokemon angry Dino could die um, and it's, that's why I've been setting out against, like, normal types and, like, some of the more normal things. No, I'm not doing that. Okay. In the literal sense, the more normal things. Because, like, I don't want to, I don't want Angry Dino to die. I like Angry Dino. So the goal is for Angry Dino not to worry about death. So... I don't know. What do, you, what do you guys, like, how do you guys feel? I mean, imagine having literally, and then I have Stone Edge, which has a 50% chance to crit. And a 20% chance to miss. And a 30% chance to do nothing. Like, 50, 30, 20. And it's like, Dino just is supposed to win coin flips that I can't. But, will Dino do that? Probably not. Because it's Dino, and he'll want to be silly. But, do I, I want him to win the coin flips so badly. Like, Angry Dino deserves to win these coin flips. Ooh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit Rock Slide. Yeah, 
The nothing. Wow. I am getting the bad. I'm getting bad rolls on this wheel. You turned into a ground type? Okay, well, I just gotta retaliate then. I am just not getting good. I'm like trying to show off angry Dino too, and it's just like Dino's like, excuse me, I don't wanna be shown off. And I'm like, but, 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 angry Dino. But I love you, angry Dino. And it's like, but no, I will die. And I'm like, okay, smart angry Dino. I love you, but like, oh my gosh. You're not helping yourself here. Angry Dino! What are you doing? Angry Dino really does not want to die. It's like, I don't care that you explained my mechanics. I'm still gonna just be angry and mad at you. And I'm like, okay, fine. I guess I have to deal with your angriness. Ugh. It's like, okay. Fine. You two come over here. Looks like everyone is here. It seems you are working hard to resurrect Reshiram and the other dragon type Pokemon, aren't you? But it appears the lightstone you seek is not here. Well then, congratulations are in order, Code. You were chosen by our king. If you truly desire to keep the world as it is, where the Pokemon live alongside people you must bring other dragon the other dragon type pokemon spoken of in the legend and battle with our king otherwise team plasma will steal every pokemon from every person in the world and release them all release them do you, the other pokemon who live with their trainers actually want that is the liberation you talk about really just stealing pokemon from people what is this champion alder even through illness took the pokemon that had been your partner for many years and you haven't had a serious battle in all that time even you who ordered the elite four to protect the pokemon league and left it to wander the unova region alone even a champion like you who now wants to protect in a world where pokemon people live together a team plasma's king will show the people of unova that he is stronger than a champion who keeps pokemon bound and just like a hero who founded Yanova, he will be accompanied by the legendary Pokemon. He will give this order. Trainers, release your Pokemon. For this, we have prepared a suitable castle for the legendary Zekrom and our king. I won't lose. I will fight for all trainers who love their Pokemon and for Pokemon who believe in their trainers. Our king has no interest in you. He has already determined that a victory against you is assured, Alder. So you stayed behind just to tell me that. You just make a fool of me? Of course not. Yes, doing this out of kindness. Yes, kindness. Making sure the champion doesn't get hurt for no reason. Granted the moment when people, someone loses all hope. I really do love to watch that moment. Then farewell. We gotta get the light stone. It's not here. It's actually in a new town. Hi, oh wait, I think I don't think I think it's literally a professor. Code name, code name, code name. Oh my god, you picked up. Come on to the museum right away. I got it. I mean, like right now, there is something in Nacarine City you want, and you better come and get it because it's actually super useful to your plans. And then it's like, okay, okay, I guess. We, we gotta go. We gotta go listen to Juniper. We, we, we do listen to Juniper. And then we do end up ending the episode. Um, after we hit Nacarine and talk to Juniper. We get to do that. So hopefully once they talk to us about how amazing everything is. And they give us the light stone. Because it doesn't literally matter. They all just say the same thing. They literally all are like, oh my god, you got the stone. And I'm like, yeah, duh. We're going to go to Opelousa's City, a place that you can go now. And that is where we'll meet you at the end of Route 8. Hopefully you guys have a wonderful day, and we will see you guys next time. Bye.